Hello, my name is Nicholas Christakis, and I'm the author of Apollo's Arrow, The Profound and Enduring Impact of Coronavirus on the Way We Live. Something very unusual has happened to us in the history of our species. A new pathogen has been introduced into our midst, and it's now going to be with us forever. It's a little bit like rats released onto an untouched island that overrun the place. This is known as an ecological release. And that is what the pathogen, what the SARS-CoV-2 virus is doing to us. It's having a field day. We have no natural immunity to it. And we know now that this pathogen is fairly serious, almost as serious as the 1918 Spanish influenza pandemic in terms of its transmissibility and in terms of its lethality. Uh, in, as of the summer of 2020, about 4% of Americans have been infected with this pathogen. And in the end, we know that about 50% will be infected. So we still have a long way to go, unfortunately. And this is going to happen whether we invent a vaccine or not, given the amount of time it's going to take to uh, develop and distribute a safe and effective vaccine. And the second wave of this pandemic is also coming in October or November right around the time that this book is going to be published. I am unfamiliar with any respiratory pandemic of the 20th century that has not had multiple waves. So we are relying on ancient ways of coping with this threat. We are separating from each other. We are pulling apart. But even as we do that, we are also banding together. We are cooperating with each other and we are sharing information. And this gives us good reason for hope and optimism that we will see the other side of this. Readers, I think, are going to want to know what is happening with the pandemic? What can they do as individuals? And what can we do as a, as a society? I think the reason, the primary reason I wrote this book is that I wanted to help with these predicaments. I wanted to help people understand what we are facing. We're going to see the other side of this pandemic. Um, plagues always end. But plagues are also themselves a part of the human condition. Plagues are not new to our species. They are just new to us.